Hello YouTube and welcome back to our channel and today we're going to be opening up a Force of the Breaker Special Edition and what's cool about this uh, Special Edition is that this came out roughly uh, I think 2007 when uh, GX was still in TV I think it was season 3 and it comes with the Force of the Breaker which introduces us to the volcanic uh, this is volcanic doomfire but what's really cool too is that this comes with the uh, Invasion of Chaos booster pack. So it's two of the Force of the Breaker and one extra booster pack, which is a. Well, it always come in three, but this one's an Invasion of Chaos. And as you can see here, it just gives you the brief description. Actually, look right here is the date. So it's July 2nd, 2007. So this is roughly 11 years ago. So, and I was able to get a good deal. I wanted to open it yesterday. But it didn't come in the mail until today, so I do apologize for that, but I thought it was going to get here yesterday. And right here we have our, what's it called, our promo card, which is uh, Phantom Beast Rock Lizard, which is uh, pretty cool. So let's go ahead and open this up and see what we pull. And can't wait to see what we get for uh, Invasion of Chaos, because you just never know what these packs, these are random, so that's pretty cool, so... I guess I gotta open the box differently, but this is as carefully. So let's see what we get. And right here we have our two packs our invasion, and let's see if I can take this out carefully. Phantom Beast Rock Loser. So. I'm going to just leave the uh, Invasion for last, so let's go ahead with Force of the Breaker and see what we get to pull. So here we have Wildfire, and just again, uh, the smell, you know, just brings back a lot of a memory. So, Last Resort, Crystal Beast, Amber Mammoth, there you go. Crystal Beast with, uh, I think it was Jesse. Crystal Abundance, Trigger Summon, Volcanic Blaster, Tornado. Nice. Introduction of Gallantry and Seismic Crasher. That's actually a pretty cool looking card right there. Look, it has a Battle Ox and a Celtic Guard. So, like I said, I am a huge fan of uh, all the artwork for every single card. Because, I mean, they just look nice and it looks like they put a lot of effort and detail into it. So, that never goes uh, unappreciated. So, we have Crystal Blessing. And actually, I was able to find a... A crystal beast, uh, Pegasus, I think is what it's called. A tin, so I might be opening that sooner than later. Heart Selling Zombie, Gravy Crush Dragon, Wildfire. Oh, sweetness, uh, Ultimate Rare Soul of Fire. Dang, look at that. I wasn't expecting much, but we actually pulled one, so that's pretty cool. Volcanic Recharge, Crystal Beast, Ruby, Carbuncle. Carbuncle, that's weird. Crystal Promise and Volcanic Scatter Shot. Wow, that's actually really cool. Uh, Ultimate Rare. That is really cool. I didn't even have sleeves out. I wasn't expecting to pull one. So that's actually a nice surprise for me too. And finally, Invasion of Chaos. So I'm really hopeful for this one. You know, we've been really nice. So we were hoping for a Dark Paladin. Oh, nice. DNA transplant right off the back. So this is actually good DNA transplant. Oh, no, it's actually DNA surgery. Oh, never mind. But still, it's, it's fine. And we have Sea Serpent, Warrior of Darkness, Chaos End, Big Koala, Berserk Gorilla, Chaos Greed. That's what we got. The Thing and the Creator, Energy Drain, and Chaos Sorcery. So pretty cool. I remember playing Big Koala a lot. Berserk Gorilla. And a lot of these cards do come out in the GX series too, so that's nice. But, I can't complain. I mean, we got one uh, Ultimate Rare, which is really cool. Let's see what it says. Your opponent draws one card. Select one Pyrotype monster from your deck and remove it from play. Inflict damage to your opponent equal to half the attack of the removed monster. If you activate this card, you cannot declare an attack this turn. So your opponent like does get to draw, but let's say a Pyro monster... Oh, this one's not pyro. 
but mostly just like the volcanic because this is, that is uh, that kind of support you know sent to the graveyard probably a high strong monster so in a way it's kind of like foolish burial but you can't attack the turn and they only lose a uh, half of the damage so it's it's cool i guess so thank you guys for watching and we'll bring you guys another video tomorrow so thank you